attending one of our golf swing in a day clinics, is it feasible that you can actually learn enough information to take away and develop a correct swing? Definitely. Um, if you're involved in, in too much technical stuff, you'll forget most of it and um, it, it just it doesn't work. But focusing on what I believe to be the real correct fundamentals and the correct components of which there aren't that many, um, taking it away and you'll then become a guarantee your own coach. You really get to know the feelings and maybe using your own camera at home, just the phone, sticking it up, very simple, having a look at yourself, you really will be able to help yourself and really develop that swing. So the idea of a golf swing a day, it's not a gimmick, this is something that really does work and we'd encourage you to, you know, come and see us. So now, so what actually are all these fundamental components that I talk about, these mysterious movements? But how do we develop that lovely fluid swing that we see with all the top players? And, and remember, you know, contrary to popular opinion, they've got their own styles uh, and they look a bit different. The core movements that we should all be aiming towards, these golfers are performing these, that's why they're so good. <laughs> um, so that lovely sort of fluid movement, movement is something that everybody can actually learn once they really actually get to understand. And I never say it's easy. And in the day, you will have a real clear picture. You won't have mastered it. That takes time. We all know you can't just suddenly change things. Any habit can't change overnight. But at least with a clear picture, you can really work towards that correct swing that really we all really want to get towards. Me, the real core fundamental, and I suppose understanding of the swing is how to actually get the club on its correct plane. In other words, how do we get that club consistently traveling in the correct direction? not coming over the top, not dropping inside here. It's all done with a very basic understanding of our anatomy. And if I said, I'm going to keep my shoulders down, elbows together, and start to just turn back and through, <laughs> it really is as basic as that. And by doing that, you'll see that my club can't really go anywhere. It's when I let my arms start to fly, suddenly it's out of control. So the, the real basic principles and, and all the positions that so many people get bogged down with, the dreaded 12 point swing plan, trying to get here, 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 all those horrible positions, understanding that fundamental and you've done it. Now, on top of correct swing mechanics, with that kind of invisible, uh, I suppose, component, how to swing the club. And that really for me is about get arms travelling same speed back through. In other words, you're not using muscle power. You're not trying to, you're not taking aim and then forcing it, which is kind of what we all want to be doing. You're not tensely guiding it. You're actually freewheeling and swinging. And ultimately then you start to use the weight of the club head. But I've got this training aid here. And the idea of this is partly if you use this regularly, you're going to get nice rhythm and swing. You know, the idea, back and forward, back and forward. But actually, once you understand how to swing, you don't need this. The club actually, as I'm doing this, if I'm just swinging back and through without interfering, now that one would gone way right. So now, if I force it, it's going left. So learning to swing, that really is key component. At the end of the Swing in the Day clinic, I guarantee we'll send you away with a really clear picture of what you need to practice. How to get yourself from here, up here, without going off at too many tangents, or any real tangents. And, and that uh, swing in the day really will get it into your mind. We also have the backup. We can, uh, you can phone, you can send us videos of, of what you're doing, making sure that you're actually practicing, and we will, we will do the critique from there. And, and as I say, getting closer and closer to this, this swing, where you have this lovely snap release of energy at the bottom, very efficient, tied in with proper mechanics, arms and shoulders not involved in the swing. So that's what we want you to really aim towards, and best of luck with it.